when you are homeless, you have a really clear analysis of how power works. So a lot of homelessness people obviously are paying attention to national politics, but are very engaged in local politics because they know all change happens locally. The homeless don't have identification, and uh, they, and their birth certificate may be in a different state, different part of the country. That's really the the main obstacle. And, and then and then there are homeless people who who just don't know what their rights are, and and don't realize that they have the right to vote even without a permanent address. Huh? I'm going for Trump. Well, you want you want to talk about why? Wonderful to meet you too. To Thanks to for talking Eric, to us. Right, yeah. Man. I love you. Do you? Uh, remember that you don't need a home to vote campaign, and it, it voter rights matter. Yeah. Uh, we have this very strong sense of civil rights and especially of, of voting. You know, we are a democracy and everyone can vote. In practice, that, that's not how it works. Uh, folks are disenfranchised because they, they can't access polls, they, can't, uh, they don't have the resources available to, uh, to learn about what the candidates are talking about, even to reach the candidates in a lot of cases. We do live in a capitalist system, uh, and the people who make the rules for voting, you know, I think they, they don't really want the opinions of poor people, and so they do everything they can to block it.